What's up, y'all? What's up, YouTube? Um, so I got some new renovation going on on the YouTube channel. Um, YouTube contacted me, and uh, I'm gonna delete a lot of my videos. Um, a couple of new rules, a couple of new standards. I won't be running parties no more with people. And if I do, their chat will not be in the video. Um, I gotta follow rules and uh, a lot of my videos I didn't edit or go over. So I'll be deleting a lot of them. I already started to. I got at least 300 videos. And this is this video is one of my first official ones for the PS5 Pro Controller. Elgato HD 60. So, if y'all need a review before y'all buy it, I got it right here. Definitely check this video out. It's a good controller. $200. Definitely worth it. But a lot of people in my chat party or in the game getting a buy by, you know, YouTube's guidelines and. They probably cursed or said whatever and can't really have that on YouTube. So, I'm starting fresh. So, it's going to be a new channel. You know, I'm not going to be able to hear the chat parties in my in my stream. Only me. It's going to be focused on me. So, hope y'all like this video. Smash that like button. Hey. What's up, YouTube? What's up, y'all? I've been meaning to do a review video on the Elgato capture card and the PS5 Pro Controller. So here we go, when you unbox it, you get a couple of things. Let's do this. I'm actually, what I should do is, I should put the camera up so y'all can see it. See if I got some settings on here. So when you open the PS5 box, I meant the PS5 Pro controller box. This is it. So, get the box, get this little bag thingy. So, it's the box, put it right here. You get like a, a little bag to put it in. I got the, it's another box that it's in. So that's basically the whole thing. It's right there. get your extra analogs this is for the charger when you plug the charger in it locks it so it basically clips onto it it opens up you hit it up and it locks simple as that then you got extra buttons right here two buttons to go under it i'll show you in another video these are extra analogs you can put them on top of the controller actually to get better like yeah it's crazy i haven't figured out how to put them actually in but my analogs do come out here's the ps5 pro controller you got two extra buttons right here two in the back and this is the setting for this i only have to tap them they don't go all the way down. Now, if I put it all the way up, they go all the way down. Middle. See the difference? So, it's definitely worth it, $200. But, yeah. So, that's that. This is the Elgato box that comes in. This is also $179.99. To me, nowadays, is it worth it? Um... Not really sure. I mean, I think it is, but I think it's not. Because nowadays you could double stream. I could stream on my PS5 on Twitch and then pull it up on my computer. And stream on YouTube with OBS and capture it. It's the same. PC players might say it's better. Why, though? It's What do you get? HD? 4K? You can't really do 4K. It's hard to do 4K. Because we barely get 4K. So, yeah, y'all can say, oh, well, some of them do 4K. They're lying to you. We don't even get 8K. So, you're not, if you're getting 4K, you got to have a setup that's worth over four, five, six, seven, eight, ten thousand dollars 
you have to be running some serious equipment. I can get 4K, but it starts to run things slower, and 3820 is what I get on my TV. I get 120 refresh rate. Y'all don't see that? Y'all get HD. And even if I'm streaming off my PS5, it's still 1080p. So, you know, it's, it's different things. It's willing if you're willing to pay. The capture card, honestly, it's just a lot going on with my music and to use a capture card. But I've been using it. I'm going to keep using it, and I'm going to keep it. So, it's definitely my review. You know, Pro Controller is definitely worth it if you're definitely a gamer. But here's the box. With a good look. It's the bottom of it. So I'm going to show you now. This is the analogs. So, what you do, you hit this release button at the bottom. And it pops, pops them up, the front up. So this pops up and comes off. And then, you lift this silver thing up right here. This comes up and pushes it out. Pushes this out. Oh, almost dropped it. See? So the analog actually comes out. And it goes in there like a chip. So, yeah. It's crazy, right? Yeah. It's definitely worth it. Because I don't have to worry about stick drift no more. My other, Now, what do you say? What do I do with my other two controllers? You can keep them for like, if your little cousins come over, your nephews, you know. And they want to play, you can let them play with that. Or when you play other games that you don't really care about, you can use them controllers. So, use your pro controller for serious games that you want to compete with your friends or, you know. But, I wanted to do this review for y'all. So y'all can actually see the pro controller. And I wanted to have a good review on here for two different things. I'm going to be releasing more videos, more reviews. If y'all want more, smash that like button. I'm going to have to edit this joint, add some beats to it, some of my beats, some music. So, you know, and as y'all can see, I have a red controller, PS5. And I have a blue one with Jack on it. So, man, the Phillies are playing right now. We need one more game, but I'm going to stay on topic. They need one more game to go to the championship, and we're in, baby. But I hope y'all enjoyed the video. You know, one thing, charging. The wire's long, but you always have to keep it almost plugged in, and it gets a little hot. Because when you get an hour charge, and you got to charge it for five hours, so you get an hour, two hours gameplay of it till it goes to, like, one bar. So there's pros and cons, so... Is it really wireless? Hmm. You know. But, uh, make sure y'all hit that like button, man. You know. I'm gonna throw some more stuff in this video. Hope y'all liked it. YS on the beat. And, uh, you know, man. Hit that like button. Smash that like button below, man. It's like, no. All right, y'all. I'm Addy. If y'all need any questions or. Y'all want to see some more stuff or like got any questions about the Pro Controller or the Elgato HD capture card, let me know. Oh, it's the Elgato HD 60X. So there's some capture cards that you can install inside your PC. And as y'all can see, I have the Mac Mini M2 Pro and I got a new AKG microphone. And I got a new setup. This is on the wall. So a lot of hard work. You already know. You already snow. Hit that like button, y'all. Appreciate it.